gentlemen, my name is Kilboy the Red, and welcome back to Astroneer Hardcore, Aatrox Landfall. So, we have every intention of finishing today. This is the third memo coil. Third memory on the third memo coil. This should... There may be one or two more fetch quests to do, but, uh... Yeah, let's get this going. Full power. Didn't work. What now? Oh yeah, we got to integrate the memory. Integrate memory. There we go. Plan. The printer is a lost cause. There is only so much one can do without a physical body to make repairs. The damage to the hardware is something I cannot fix. The comm system is another matter. We're still receiving messages, we just can't send them. I've rerouted the Elysium systems through the training program and visualized them as part of the gate they ex exercise. This should allow the astroneers to help me repair the communication nodes under the guise of the training program's mission structure. There's still the pa still the problem how to power the comm system. I can't use the Elysium's power cells for this. I've redirected everything to the training program, as it may be years before rescue arrives. There is a single power core I could draw from, one unnecessary system that could be used to send a message. Strange. Our current system must be using old files of Solo appears that in every instance of the training program, DeSolo is st still a full moon. The real DeSolo, DeSolo is split nearly down the middle with stray broken pieces trading an asteroid belt asteroid-like belt in the center. I'm still not entirely sure how the have, having disaster occurred. The astronaut who committed a bizarre crime claimed he was following instructions which could, which could not possibly be true. <laughs> that's a, uh, that's a YouTube reference. There's a lot of astronaut YouTubers that try and destroy the solo. The Elysium crew members in their training, in the training program must carry a deep subconscious need Deep subconscious need to recreate the having disaster. We explain why they keep blowing the poor moon to smithereens. <laughs> yes. Thank you, YouTube. Thank you, Game Devs, for recognizing YouTube's contribution to the success and life of your game. Oh, yes. Very fancy suit. Itchy pretty. Okay. Next. My memory now is here in the sunroom. Yes. Okay. Row. Okay, I'm going to take a hot second. Unload my guff into the into the ship.
Friday. Integrate the last memory. Corruption. How long has it been? Data missing. Years, maybe. The training program is never meant to run at this capacity under these circumstances. Files from the Elysium records are bleeding into the mission system. The <laughs> log stop are occurring. For the measures to stabilize. Critical failure, but the mission system areas are accumulating and there's only so much of myself left to patch it all with. If I want to retain consciousness, I must prioritize the life support's longevity. Silva. Silva is an idyllic place to train new astroneers, and for the most part that has remained true since the crash of the Elysium. It has always been a lush planet, a haven for natural resources and what Exo sought to conserve. But the data to eh, instantiate fauna into the training program was corrupted by the failure Mind bank. The only creature to set foot on this silva has been the humble Galastropod. I sp suspect that was a matter of the data from the Triton somehow crossing into the simulation. To me, it illustrates the beauty and possibility of our universe. Even in simulation, new things can grow and flourish. If I may leave a few words for Eva specifically, I have no doubt you will carry out my mission, but I hope parsing these log files with you... These logs fill you with the same sense of wonder that has guided me. You are my creation, but you have become so much more. It is my wish for you to be a companion to our crew, to help them find their way and to show them that there is no end to the incredible things they can achieve. I know I am leaving them in capable hands. Alright. Mission log. What do we got? Right. Authorize Eva to send SOS signal. Alrighty. Signal away. Right. Let's access the sunroom log. Right. reading this, and that means you were able to work with Eva to send our SOS to EXO. It also means that all remains of myself has been used to power the communication system and reinforce the training program. It was my greatest joy to live with you as part of the Elysium crew, to watch you flourish and grow, even when you no longer remembered my name. I have so little to leave you, well, leave you with, but I know that I could have given everything. This lifeboat I've created for you will hold steady now. For weeks, months, years, you will survive. And while I can no longer wait alongside you, please be patient a while longer. They will come for you. This is not the end. Till then, this world is yours. I wish the stars for you, my dearest friends. Kronos, AI Caretaker, ESS Elysium. The Astroneer Training Program is your ticket to accelerated job proficiency and a keen mind. In this controlled virtual environment, you will learn everything you need to do. You need to stay up to date on EXO's latest practices, technology, and research across the galaxy. 
knowledge that's sure to help you excel, whether you're stationed on a planet, a starship, or far beyond. Upon completion of the astroneer training program, participants will be formally certified for deep space exploration and will receive priority access to cutting-edge technology. More importantly, the program is a key part of the mental exercise that's vital for astroneers. Unique life forms require unique solutions, and while your body may be replaceable, your mind is not. Keep it sharp at the astroneer training program. Ask your friendly EXO representative for more information today. Yeah, same problem. You only get one seed. All righty. Crack the rose, planted on Silva. Okay, Silva it is. Out of control. Oh, righty. Um, where's my land pad? Uh, there we are. Oh, oh better, I better. I need to grab one. Well, well fuck it. That's just. Go ahead and... Since I'm over here, resupply the nails on the backpack. Throw a uh, rose down and climb up. Hello, it's good to see you again. I noticed you're constrained by pesky things like gravity in some parts of the simulation. If you give me one of the decryption keys, my favorite food, I can temporarily break the simulation to aid you in defying this arbitrary restriction. Hybrid rose seeds. So, to that end... Yes. And so... I now have the power of creative light.
Blammo. Perfect. The only thing left to do is through the looking glass. To that end, we are actually going to unload the backpack. I don't know why I'm being anal with the organization, but... Well, darn, I thought I was going to be able to fit it all on the... Under ship. You know what? No sense of stockpiling these things. Happy birthday! I just wish you could actually pan up to your camera to look at it. Come on. To the ramp. There we go. Last two slots. I mean, I suppose I could have just printed out another medium storage and threw it on there. But, uh, right. Okay, backpack empty into the spacecraft. We take the spacecraft and put it at the rip at home, and then we're going to fast travel to the satellite. There we go. And upon arrival, we are then going to create an exit save, duplicate the save, and then we will walk through the looking glass. Hey, okay, hello, Cole. To the planetary core. Right node, cosmic elevation. Okay. 
duplicate the save time. to delete the old backup duplicate and you're probably wondering why well frankly I don't trust a system era to have properly integrated the constraints of hard mode into the course of events that happens when you finish the game. So, an ounce of progression, pre, an ounce of preparation is worth a pound of regret. So to that end, we have, we have made a save file duplication at the standing on the satellite the satellite is fully active all of the other missions are complete everything is back at base the only thing left to do is gaze into the odd stone and to that end Astroneer training program. Oh, it's, maybe that was from the original. I don't know. It's poor Paul. Assist Mirror Team would like to thank our families for their support and encouragement, love, cookies, and patience. Friends, college mentors, astronaut fans, and everyone who cheers along the way. We hope that astronaut inspires you to look up at the stars and wonder what mysteries the vastness of space may hold. Well, alrighty then. We didn't get the uh, end credits. We didn't actually get the end credits. But, uh, okay. Well done, System Era. You have successfully integrated the constraints of hard mode into the end screen animatic. But, we unlocked a color palette. Old gold. Come on, you fucking thing. And let's get 
rid of the hat. Okay. None. None. Come on, you fucking thing. Um. I do tend to like the flight suit. Oh, I don't like that. No, I don't like that. Arid suit. Evening suit. Water suit. Lab suit. I got Kronos. Hard suit and the conductor suit. His legs are too skinny. I do like the conductor suit. I'm running the hard suit. I think it's time for a change. And let's go with the lab suit. The lab suit doesn't look too bad in gold. What visor should we have? Mirror gold. That may just be too much gold. Silver. And... Mm, got the galactic theme. No rust. Solo. That's kind of pretty. Pumpkin. Gear. And this bubble head. Ball and count. Yeah. All of us. We got the palette we want. Hats. I do like the gear head. I don't like how that doesn't change color. Yeah, I don't like that. Eh, it's a bit ostentatious, to be perfectly honest. Gear head. No. No. Save outfit. Outfit one. Default. It's just outfit three is just straight up default. Oh yeah, Christmas face. Perfect. Well, that is pretty much everything. Back there.
Yeah, unfortunately. The actual decryption keys are her favorite food, not the rose seed. Snail power. Actually, I'm thinking we might. Right. Relax to put my Flower. Boom. Do 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 do. This guy wants the boom. We are full snail power. Okay. That is going to do it for the hardcore series. How are we doing on time? Yeah, we're half an hour. In. So, we're going to end this we're going to end this particular episode and then get started on the hard we're gonna get started on the, the exo request missions the automated mass production protocol amp we're gonna get amped up we're gonna earn the new stuff right here in this save file so thanks for coming along for the ride